Today guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can test your microphone and camera in Microsoft Teams without joining a meeting. Let's get started. Okay guys, so I've just got Microsoft Teams open here and the first thing that we want to do is actually head on over to our settings. So to do that, we have our kind of little three dots just up here for settings and more. We're going to click on those and then we get to settings. We click on settings here. There's actually a couple of different ways you can navigate to your settings. I just find that the simplest one to go to. From here, you will have all of your setting menus open. On the left hand side, we want to go down to where it says devices. Click on that. From here, you have various different things. So if you scroll down to where it says video settings here, you're going to want to make sure that you have your right kind of camera camera selected. I've got the Camlink Pro, so I have four different camera views here. I'm just going to choose camera one, uh, which is the one that I used for the intro of the video. Um, we obviously have different settings for your camera, all that kind of stuff, but we don't need to worry about those unless there's something specifically wrong with yours. Um, scroll up a little bit to where you have your audio settings. You want to make sure your headphones are correct. So I'm going to go ahead and put those onto my correct headphones. Make sure that my microphone is correct. I'm going to use the Shure MV7 for this one. And then what we're going to do is we're going to click on make a test call. Once we click on make a test call, it does open on a different screen. I'm just going to pull that over here um, and bring it into view. You can see that this is testing out your actual camera and you have this kind of test call going on. It's not a real call or anything like that, um, but you can see that your camera is working down here at the bottom. So you can test, mess around with your camera settings um, and see what is going on. You can obviously change this view up as well. You can have it as speaker if you want. Uh, you can obviously change the view into a few different options if you wanted to, um, such as full screen, you know, add share display, turn off the incoming call, show gallery at the top, these kind of things. And um, it give you a little bit of different ways to kind of view what is going on. But ultimately that is gonna be how you kind of view your camera and can test that your camera is indeed working inside Microsoft Teams without actually joining a meeting first. You can actually just go ahead and create that test call. I'm just gonna leave this one. I'm gonna close that down. So you can see that this comes under the audio section for testing a call or to make a test call. It's not under the video area. It is under the audio. I'm not sure why they don't have it in both areas, um, but ultimately that is exactly how you would go ahead and test your video and your camera is working before joining a meeting. And so guys, it is as easy as that to essentially make sure and test that your video, your camera is working before joining a meeting. If this works for you guys, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more hints and tips, and I'll catch you in the next one.